me stats here and welcome back to Brawl Stars. Today, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to be talking over some of the power play games that I did this day at least, which it was like yesterday. But I started out with power play games. Now bear in mind, I've never played power play at all. I know, I think I'm aware you can only use one brawler, not just one brawler, any brawler that has a star power. And the only one I actually that have, have a, that I have that has a star power is Shelly. Uh, so yeah, this is my very first game ever doing power play. I always unlock it for the event, but I never do it. So I'm rocking out with PSG Shelly. I can see a BB there. There's also some teaming going on. I feel like this Barley was either trying to team with me, but now I realize they were teaming with the bull there. So uh, I'm kind of in a tricky situation here. I only have one power up cube. And I don't know what to do. I don't I don't want to team. Uh, I know in certain situations I can team and I'll end up probably winning if I do. And then I get surprised by another bull. And I mean, as soon as I use my super, I get taken out. So that was my first power play game. I didn't get anything for it, but Oh, I got 14, 14, but I roll into the next game and I'm just like, okay, I need to play this a lot better because at the time I can only play three games. I'm just like, let me just test out power play, see how I like it. You guys really want to see a power play series. So now I'll know to take it even more serious uh, in the near future, uh, shall I say. So this one, I'm kind of just trying to play a little bit passive aggressive. I was worried about this Leon because I know having Leon up close to you does so like Leon does so much damage and I just I just really want to avoid Leon at all cause especially the fact that Leon is also super fast as well so we got bull in the middle with five power up cubes now about to be six and there's not really much I can do in this situation all I gotta do is I'm thinking okay I'm just gonna play this safe and I'm gonna either just kind of have to pick up some kills like kind of third party where two people are fighting and then I kind of show up and get a kill um, because yeah, there's just no way possible I'm gonna be able to do this But I do see a Shelly here that's quite weak and taking a lot of damage So I figure out this is my opportunity and soon as Shelly got taken out I swoop in with my gadget and I steal the two power-up cubes So uh, yeah right now what we got three brawlers left uh, Spike has just died So it looks like it's Brock and we got Leon still this Leon is a, it's gonna be a problem uh, 100% I don't remember if I died by this Leon, but I know that that Leon's a problem Leons are always problems in showdowns, at least for me, at least. So we got another Shelly there. I don't think Shelly even realizes that I'm here just yet. So, again, playing this very safe. I probably shouldn't have shot there, but I just wanted to kind of get my super. So I think that's exactly what I was doing. I was just trying to get my super. But I'm going to rush in to this Shelly, and I'm going to use my super. There we have it. And I'm just going to try and dash away from Leon so I can at least heal up. And I didn't realize that was actually a clone. So... Yeah, um, this this is very yeah, this is a tricky situation here again it, it all boiled down to this Leon the Leon I was afraid of at least and I'm trying to do some damage But look at this Leon can just back away so quick And there it is Leon managed to take me out and I, I lost that second game But however, we did way better than the first one because I just kind of didn't know what to expect so there we have it So total of 48 we have now, but we roll into our last and final power play game guys and I'm just like okay I played that second one pretty good if I can just replicate that but the beginning of this kind of threw me off a little bit because honestly I was able to pick up so many power-up cubes and nobody showed up I was like uh, is this game or, or is something glitch for me right now I'm just sitting there waiting like okay no one's gonna come out of a bush and shoot me right now <laughs> it's funny like looking back at it now uh, but yeah nobody like came after me in this I was like well you know what I don't think anybody's here. I can see Tara is somewhere, but other than that, nobody's around. And I got six power-up cubes. I'm just like, oh, this is brilliant. This is perfect. Like, where is everybody? And and how is this even possible? Oh, and there's another Leon. And look how look how much damage Leon does. Like, it's ridiculous. Really ridiculous how strong Leon is. Like, there's just no way. And here's also another Leon as well. And this Leon has no idea that I'm here. So I kind of want to surprise this Leon if he comes over this way. He's super weak as well. So I'm going to definitely go for this kill. Dash over. Couple shots. And there we go. So eight power-up cubes. Looking good here. Now I'm, I'm feeling pretty confident that I can win this game. But at the same time, anything can happen. These are very good players, uh, by the way. And I, and I stopped using Shelly for a long time. I think you guys know that. Shelly was probably one of my favorite brawlers. Uh, at the beginning, but then it yeah, it was like kind of Shelly was all I all I knew so um, Tar is pretty weak. I probably could have pushed that but I ran out of my gadget So I didn't actually have my gadget, but 
yeah, we have a Leon there. Again, I'm not trying to team at all. That's the thing. Um, and, and, and this Leon has six power-up cubes. So the last one killed me last game. Oh, we got Tara here. Boom. And then, yeah. So Tara managed to throw the super down. And it hit me. And then, uh, yeah, Sandy just came out of nowhere. I didn't even see the Sandy the whole entire time. So that was our third game. We lost it. I kind of stuck around to see exactly who won this one. And to my surprise, I believe it was Sandy, was it not? Or was it Leon? It could have been Leon, actually. No, Sandy ended up winning. So we got rank three, not bad. Um, total 78. So those are the power play game guys but what I'll do is is I'll probably just play them more but this time I just rolled into some duo showdowns I was like you know what my power play games are exhausted so I'm gonna roll into some some duo showdowns and see how I do so I want to talk about these games because these are some pretty decent games too and and believe it or not I was playing with some randoms too and they, they weren't bad like I mean sometimes people joining games it's like you know Big B you know you always get to play with good players and I play at randoms but Honestly, some of the randoms I play are actually quite good sometimes. Um, and yeah, we managed to take out Dynamite there. I mean, we're both chilling on five or six power-up cubes right now. Six, uh, actually. So we know there's a lot of people in the bush, too, as well. So um, this, this, like, we're just really controlling this. I can tell my, my, my teammate is pretty aggressive, too. So it's not like I have to do so much bull is there as well. And I didn't want to waste my super there. I had to be smart with that. I actually did, ended up kind of wasting my super. But I knew it would slow him down, and this was a this was a tough situation. I really panicked here because I was going to a place where it was kind of like a dead end, and M's at that distance is just dangerous. So, but we're gonna end up taking. I think we end, oh, my team ends up taking out M's, and I think I'm gonna try and go in and just go in for support here. This is also tricky, and I really tried to stay away from the range uh, of Jesse's uh, super here because. Jesse was using her gadget to try and stun you and kind of slow you down and then just straight shoot you. So, uh, yeah, it was very key that I didn't actually do this. Uh, I, did, I wanted to use my super there, but I was like, you know what? I'm, I'm trying to work on and I'm trying to get better at saving my super, especially with Shelly. Uh, like, up close, at least. Like, either stun him and then shoot him three times or shoot him three times, then use the super. Um, but we managed to take him out. Showdown time. I mean, look at this. We're chilling on 16. Uh, power-up cubes right now so a total of 32 power-up cubes uh, ladies and gentlemen and, and yeah there, there's like really nothing and look at this teammates in the corner bull is there and bull is dead and we managed to win the game so super super happy about that one there it is and I think we maybe go into another game I'm not hundred percent certain I'm not sure though but let's see I think we yeah we go into another game we actually play really well uh, together so Ozva Ozva King if you're watching this we did good buddy we did good so this one, we're just kind of sticking to the same type of strategy. I do, like, the, the thing is with, with Brawl Stars, it's funny how, like, there's kind of no communication, but I play definitely different with def different people I know uh, as well. So, like, some people from the club I know I can always win with, not just because of them. Like, we just play really good together, and then some people, maybe we lose uh, more games than win. So, it, it's always, it all depends on how, how two people play and their play style, at least. I, I've always been kind of like a passive-aggressive player, like... I feel like sometimes I play aggressive when I'm needed to play aggressive, but there's probably some certain instances where I could be a bit more aggressive, uh, but then I'm not, so uh, I, I should probably really, I'm going to dash in there and I'm going to try and take them out, and I think I managed to, yeah, there we go, look at that, managed to get in there and get out, now I was already wondering, like, okay, this might be, oh yeah, my teammate just got taken out as well, I'm going to try and take out this Sandy, somehow, Sandy's right there, and there we go. And I'm also gonna save these power-up cues. The big B back in the day would have just swooped these up, but then again, I didn't know that, and you guys taught me that. So, yeah, I'm gonna save those power-up cues for my teammate. So he gets three there. I'm sitting on 13 right now. And yeah, it's like a repeat from the last game. I think we end up catching these people in the corner over here as well. Like, this seems to be the corner that most people hide in uh, all the time. And I think I'm gonna end up trying to get really close to Dynamite. That might just do this super right in front. Bad move there. And then we have Bo in there. I actually get caught by both of these. I did not expect that. And I think if I wasn't careful, I was probably going to die there. But we managed to take him out. And we get the win. So very good game there. Extremely good game. And I was like, why couldn't I do this good in the power play games that we did? You know? But yeah, that's Duo Showdown for you. So we're going to roll into one more game here. But this is actually with another random uh, as well. Uh, sorry for calling it your random. But you know. I don't 
don't know you. I don't know you. Uh, so yeah, this one they have Rosa. So now, now this is this was a very very interesting game here. I, I'll be honest because uh, they were using the close range brawler. I would say, I mean, I, I guess I would say Shelly is not a close range brawler, but you do way more damage up close than far away with the Shelly. So uh, we have this annoying crow though here. I always find crow to be really annoying just because I hate, I hate in, in any game, um, which you know there always is where there's a weapon or, or something that poisons you or, or gives you like a burning effect and then you're kind of just stuck taking damage. Uh, for a while, but I mean hey that that's what it is and that's what makes um, Crow special. I wonder if we'll ever get like another poison brawler though And this crow is just really determined to take me out and there's Rose uh, Versus Rosa there again Rosa versus Rosa All right, and then we got a Pam here Pam had no idea. And this is what I mean like being up close like this Nightmare when you have Shelly like they they just don't and then we have Piper here Piper got me so weak honestly. I don't know if I actually get taken out in this. I was really kind of panicking um, a lot and I was like let me just dash out and this crow comes in and we managed to just take out everybody there like and I thought I was gonna die here from the poison effect but I didn't luckily so yeah I mean look at this we, we're just doing really really good here I gotta remember too that this is like a damage booster and I don't think it I don't think it actually heals right it is a damage booster from 8-bit so I sometimes make that mistake at least all right we're just gonna take that out and now we have Brock. I just need to heal up, basically. And, and Brock hit me, like, every time in this. Like, every time. So I kind of just leave it to, to my... to my, to my, Oh, and look at that. We didn't expect him to also jump away, either. So we're both just chasing Brock down to the ends of the Earth. And then, yeah, there we have it. We managed to win the game. So that was awesome. So that, that was great. There was some good games uh, this day, and I'm very, very happy. Uh, I played those duos as well after the Power Play games. But... That's gonna wrap it up for the video. Let me know if you guys wanna see me do more power play games. Uh, maybe I'll make a whole video of me doing power play games, so I'll be more on point when I can play three games, and I'll just kinda of pile them up and bring it out for an episode. But thank you all so much for tuning in. If you did enjoy, feel free to leave a like and share it, and feel free to subscribe for more. And if you're new, and I will see you in the next video.